Take a picture of your daughter at a baseball game and there is something obstructing it. We can do the hard work, remove the obstruction. And have the picture of what matters to you in front of you. We are clearly at an inflection point with vision. And so today we are announcing a new initiative called Google Lens. Google Lens is a set of vision-based computing capabilities that can understand what you're looking at and help you take action based on that information. We'll ship it first in Google Assistant and Photos, and it'll come to other products. So how does it work? So for example, if you run into something and you want to know what it is, say a flower, you can invoke Google Lens from your assistant, point your phone at it, and we can tell you what flower it is. It's great for someone like me with allergies. <laughs> or if you've ever been at a friend's place and you've crawled under a desk just to get the username and password from a Wi-Fi router, you can point your phone at it. <laughs> and we can automatically do the hard work for you. Or if you're walking in a street downtown and you see a set of restaurants across you, you can point your phone because we know where you are and we have our knowledge graph and we know what you're looking at, we can give you the right information in a meaningful way. As you can see, we are beginning to understand images and videos. All of Google was built because we started understanding text and web pages. So the fact that computers can understand images and videos has profound implications for our core mission. When we started working on search, we wanted to do it at scale. This is why we rethought our uh, computational architecture. We designed our data centers from the ground up.